Hello Darts Nuts, welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing another set from Galaxy Barrel Design and these are the Jake the Truth Taylor Darts. Obviously that's a very good name to have if you're a dart player, Taylor. <laughs> so let's check them out. I'm reviewing the 24 gram version the 95% tungsten, they're also in 22 gram, there is no soft tip and they retail for £54.95. So as you can see it comes in this cardboard packaging and you've got a picture of the player and the darts on the back there. Jake the Truth Taylor. Inside you've got a plastic tray and the darts are fitted into a little point holder well stuck in there and they come supplied with the in-between L style Laro stems and the flights Galaxy standard shape pre-slotted for the rings. The darts fit with a silver point it's a straight barrel dart you've got a slight tapered nose and apart from a couple of sections you've got grip pretty much the whole of the dart and it's a, a very thin double ring grip and slightly wider grooves in between each set of double rings. You'll probably see that better in the close up next level. But obviously you've got a smooth section there with the Truth logo and the Galaxy Darts logo and then just a small bit on the end. But a good classic style of dart I think, which should work for many. And fitted with the L-style Laro stems, like I mentioned, and the Galaxy standard shape flights. It's got a slightly tapered nose, and it's just a, a ring and groove grip, like double rings, and square cut grooves in between each double ring, and then slightly beveled grooves in between each set of rings. And pretty much the full length of the dart is that and then you've got a smooth band with the Galaxy logo and then the players logo the truth and then on the rear it continues the same grip pattern and just a slight taper on the end of the barrel so there you go that's the super close look at the Jake Taylor darts the darts fit with a silver 28mm point, there's a slight taper at the front, 3.8mm but still has the thin ring grip and then a section of the double thin ring grip which is 27.5mm before you get into a smooth section of 5mm then more of the double ring grip 13.5mm and then a small tapered smooth section 2.2mm length 52mm width 6.35mm Twenty three point nine three grams, twenty three point nine four grams, and twenty four point zero four. Full setup, twenty five point six two grams. Here's the balance with nothing attached and with the supplied setup and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights. Maybe slightly above medium so 5.5 but it could feel a little bit grippy at the sum. I think the grip may be just about medium level but it could be one of them slightly quirky grips in the fact that some people may find it more grippy than others oh two in the treble right the only reason why i say that is because just holding it up for your throw with the light grip it's not like massively grippy but you only need to put a little bit of pressure on and you start to feel like the edges of the rings but 
that could be just out of the fact that it's new and the rings are still sharply defined I like the fact the grip is right up to the nose and I like a kind of a bull nose anyway and that's like a like a tapered bull nose so for a front grip holding it close to the nose it feels quite nice releases out your fingers nice and easy um, I'll try it from the middle section I think that's just in front of the dreaded smooth part <laughs> I know there's often a smooth part on barrels and they all seem to be in the wrong spot for someone <laughs> Well, <laughs> they're grouped, <laughs> but like I say, straight barrel dart, they always work, whether you're front, mid or rear grip. It just depends whether the dimensions and everything work for you, but I think for mid grippers you'll be fine there. Um, that smooth section is kind of like halfway between the mid and the rear, but if you're gripping close to the end of the barrel as a rear gripper, then you're still getting the same grip so I'll try it from there a bit more fish tail for me but <laughs> if you're a natural rear gripper you'll be fine I think so I think it's probably a good all-rounder really it's just another kind of like a goldilocks one not too grippy and not too slippy and grip apart from the smooth part is on most of the barrel um maybe a touch on the long side for me personally but the thickness the uh the the width of the barrel just about right i think There's one. There's two. Trusty old double three again. There's three. There's four. There's five. Three in a row, you get another go. There's seven. That's close on quite a few, like. There's eight. Oh. There's nine. Ah, oh, 
I think I just equaled the record that I had. Nine. Four points. Oh, I think it was 33, if I counted it right. Oh, two points. Seven points. Oh, I got a bullseye. Great start, that. That's a hundred. Yeah, yeah, it is a hundred. <laughs> two bull, uh, two twenty fives, and a bullseye. It's broke. Oh, it's broken. Another bullseye. Oh, <laughs> Robin Hooded it. I have knackered the stem now. <laughs> oh, great. It's uh, 150 after six. Hundred and seventy five after nine. Oh, come on. Two hundred after twelve, that's three. That's 250. So there you go, that's the Galaxy Jake the Truth Taylor Darts, a neat 95% tungsten barrel. And like I said, some people may find it more grippy than others. I'd probably still say it's around about a medium level. And it's a dart that should work for all. Obviously, it, it, if you're gripping where the smooth part is and you actually need some grip, then it might not be for you. But anywhere else is fine. Got quite a nice feel to the grip. And it just has that like solid kind of like Goldilocks feel, like the good all-rounder classic straight barrel dart so one that i think might suit many people actually so i'll leave you with the gallery so you can have a close look at them if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do so and i'll see you in the next one happy darting